good morning guys welcome back to another video if you have not subscribed kindly subscribe if you are a returning subscriber thank you very much for always clicking in and don't forget to turn your notification bell and so that every time i open upload a video you will be notified and you will be the first person to watch my video and today's video we are going to talk about 10 reasons why vaccinations are important for our health why vaccinations are important for our health especially for the babies and especially for the diseases that are invisible so let's say throughout our life we expose we are exposed to a number of viruses bacteria and other microbes some of these microbes benefit us while others causes diseases that could result to several illness uh, and also they can result to um, several disability and also even death that is why it is important to vaccinate ourselves or to uh, vaccinate our baby so we are going to look at some of the 10 factors 10 points uh, that the reason 10 points 10 reasons why vaccination or immunization are important for our health so, so let me say that our body immune system protect us against several uh, infection by triggering reaction that neutralize that neutralize harmful microbes and prevent the infection but it cannot fight certain diseases like the coronavirus yeah sometimes sometimes it cannot fight cannot our body system cannot fight some diseases like coronavirus coronavirus that is why vaccination play a huge important role as they help the immune system to create antibody that protect the body from diseases the spread of disease and its effective tackling um, tacking okay I, what am i saying the spread of diseases and uh, maybe the spread of some diseases are just about the the ignorance of our ourselves so uh, as i have said we are going to look at the some of the 10 10 points reason why we should get immunized or we should get vaccination or we should be vaccinated and number one number one number one reason number one reason so effective it 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 make our body effective pro protection from dangerous diseases and also better health i'm i'm saying it helped the body immunization or vaccination help the body to have effective protection from dangerous diseases and, and better health i mean you will have a better health vaccine help our body um, build an immunity to a disease and prevent us from falling illness or from getting that disease children and adults can protect from infection in the most effective way through vaccination and therefore we should get vaccination because it gives the body that ability to protect against dangerous diseases they are available these vaccines are available and they are free in most of the hospital and also they are accessible and they, then they are also affordable the government it has put it clear that all vaccines are, should be given to a pregnant mother to to anyone who is at risk of getting a disease and also to all the newborn babies these this, these vaccines are always free they are always free and i can assure you that the government hospital always over a cold chain system that make the 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 vaccine to be potent for several years and several hours and several days and therefore they are safe they are affordable and then they are as accessible to all 
government hospital so you should not get an excuse of not getting immunization or should not get an excuse of not taking your baby to be immunized because those these vaccines are all of them are available affordable accessible everywhere in all government hospitals congratulations the government of Kenya and because of their availability affordability uh -huh, it's lower the medical bills and higher life expectancy you know if some disease these diseases are not eradicated or if they if somebody get these diseases uh, somebody may suffer from other disability that will lead to higher life expectancy whereby maybe if someone is disabled this person will live with a disability that will need to be uh, this person maybe will need a wheelchair in future and this person will need a lot of equipment for this person to live a normal life and therefore if you take your baby for to get immunization you prevent you 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 you, you lower the medical bills in the hospitals and also you 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 make a higher life expectancy and you make life very important and very easy for these children when they grow up and then another thing childhood vaccination secure health and development i mean it's secure health according to i mean to to the government it is important to for every child to get vaccinated so that they don't get these diseases that can cause disability. They don't get these diseases that cause disability and also they can, these diseases, some of them lower immunity. And therefore, it is always good for you to take your baby for immunization. The seventh point is it protects the child and others. If you immunize your child, it, you protect that child and also you protect others. You see some, some of these immunizable diseases, they are contagious. They can spread from one person to another. And therefore, you, if you immunize your child, you are protecting also other child and also you are protecting yourself. Like a chicken pox, if you get a chicken pox, you can get, even the parent can also get it if you are attending to that child. You, it can spread to other people. If 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 it if it, because these diseases some of them they spread to one person to another so in short you protect your child and also you protect other people the eighth point is that uh it helps in developing herd immunity in the society we usually have some people who are very difficult to 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 accept the reality so these people they don't usually take their babies for all their they are the their babies for immunization they usually don't they don't i know there are some people who still up to now they don't take their children the children for to get immunization and so you see that if a large population is immunized in the in the in the community or in the region it helps in acquiring herd immunity these are the people who are very difficult to to, 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 to accept the reality that to, to which word can I use to these people who are still ignorant they cannot take their babies for for for, for immunization you protect their babies from getting other diseases I mean you help by immunizing the, the a large number of population 90 80 to 90 percent you help in acquiring herd immunity uh, and also the 10th point is it helps in prevention of related diseases. Vaccines are also effective in protecting against diseases related to the targeted diseases. For example, if someone is suffering from measles, this person is, is likely to get uh, dysentery, bacterial pneumonia, uh, malnutrition the child will suffer from other related diseases and therefore if you immunize this child you protect uh, you protect him or her from getting other related diseases and also the tenth point and the last one is it enhance social and economic equity it enhances your economic equity. Uh, hey, what am I saying? The burden of infection, infectious diseases, I mean, the burden of infectious diseases is greater on the disadvantaged and, um, 
and vaccine have clear benefit for them so you see those who are not capable of of even taking the the what the kids to a better hospital when the child get get what get sick then this the the, the what the the if you they get immunized you protect them and you enhance by protecting them you enhance socioeconomic factors in the community so i think this is the end of this video and thank you for watching this video you can leave a comment you can share you can like don't forget to turn your notification bell and also make sure you are always watching this video because we are making learning easy at the comfort of your zone so bye let's meet in my next video